Um, today we're going to do a paper pumpkin. This is the newest paper pumpkin and um, this is the seventh anniversary which inside you received an additional stamp set which was their, their gift for that. This is the set that goes with the, the stamp set and this is the set the stamp set are in addition to what you um, would normally receive so this month is a um, it's the basic gray stamp and spot the um, set itself is oops I'm hard to get out of here. <laughs> That's out of the way. Okay, let's see what we get. <laughs> really a surprise. <laughs> We don't know anything about the stamp set. We don't know what it's like or anything. It's all a surprise when you get it every month. We They do send out little hints and so forth. That's why we knew that we were getting two stamp sets, but we had no idea what they were like or anything. So everything's a real surprise when you get it. It's all better than Christmas. <laughs> okay. okay, so this is our... Looks like we have some raindrops, epoxy raindrops, some stamping, some um, glue, glue dots. We have some, um, looks like a designer thread. We have, um, oh, these are great. These are the dimensionals. And this month it's a, um, they're note card sizes, so it's a little bit smaller. And um, I prefer to make larger cards than what the, these are. So what I'm going to do is, oh, these are the, the pre-cut, um, you can punch these out individually. Yeah, very cute. These are, yeah, these are nice. So. We're going to have some fun. Okay. And okay, this is the card set. I like to make at least one or two from the set to demonstrate it. And then from there I'll use the rest to make my own designer cards. So, I like things to be special when I send it out. <laughs> And they are special. They're always special because you make them, you put them together yourself and it just helps you to be a little more creative, a little, and you have a little more ability to think outside the box. And uh, looks like there's three designs and these are the labels that go with it for um, stamping your sentiment on the outside. So let's get cracking. <laughs> Our instructions are on the back of the cardboard. So this cardboard away. We'll just throw it away. We'll just I keep it for when I need chipboard for crafts. So it's really nice. Okay, so this is the first one. First, second, third. Okay. Pretty simple. <clears throat> And they do give you suggestions on the back for for more designs. If you wanted to do a tag, here's a design. Here's a bigger card, the standard card. This is a little note card. Uh, the, looks like a three three and a half by three and a half. So, but we'll we'll look at that in a minute. Okay, so let's get one of these out each. One, two. It looks like there's about two one. 
Okay, so there's 12 note cards, so three, four of each design, which is pretty generous. Okay, so let's take out these boots. Oops, take those out. <clears throat> How's everybody doing out there? It's <clears throat> kind of a difficult time for our country, but we're going to get through this. And if a person can stay busy, doing something they enjoy, it, time will go by much quicker. So, that's why I love crafting. <laughs> so enjoyable, so relaxing. Helps you get through the day. Helps you get through the tough times. Okay, our, our envelope has a inside lining. We have three. Three different designs, okay? So here we go. Set this aside. Looks like the first thing we need to do is let's just toss all these right there so we can have them handy. Let's do I'm gonna do the cloud first. Let's do this one first, okay? Big enough for it here. Okay, I'm going to use my big stamping spot. I'll burnish the edge of the bone folder and let's get our. Ready. <coughs> Okay, and I'm going to put protective paper underneath it so that I can stamp off the card. When you stamp with our pads, normally they come, when you purchase, first purchase them, they're pretty loaded with the inks. I always buy, when I buy a stamp pad, I always buy the, um, the refill. That way I have it when it does go dry. <laughs> because they will. Okay, so we're going to just damp the, the clouds. And we're going to do it in a variety of manner, okay? Good. I like that. Okay, so let's look at our example again. And here we go. We're going to use the yellow boots. This is a pretty easy stamp set this time. Okay, so we're going to set the boots right here on the grass, nice and slow. And then we're going to use the, okay, I thought there was some yellow floral. Okay, there must be another thing of flowers that I overlooked. Let's see. Okay, so let's go here. 
you kind of line up the, the boot with the grass below and you want to let's kind of put this in the boot and outside the boot we want to keep it inside the, the frame so let's do it like like so going to put that like that okay put the grass this is how we're going to do it okay it looks like it's coming out of the boot okay if we clip it right here on that side that would look good right there that looks good yeah and then we will okay we need the round labels so we need to stamp the round label what do you do with the labels oh these are the labels okay so we want a round one <clears throat> What is it that we're going to say on the round one? No matter the weather, we're in it together. I like that. That's very cute. <laughs> Okay, so let's stamp this. What do I do with it right here? It kind of doesn't stand out, does it? No matter the weather, we're in it together. I don't like how I did that. Whoops. Well, we'll just use it. <laughs> okay. So let's get this stamped down. I'm going to do... Oh, I know what I'll do. I'll put... A heart up there. You can put a heart right there to fill that in. There we go. Okay. I don't, um, I generally save my dimensionals and things that they provide and uh, use my own. I save those for, for traveling or sometimes I give them out as gifts. There's nice little incentives and thank yous for purchasing or becoming a, a demonstrator with me. Um, several things Stampin' Up! does for us. I think it'd be going off. Yes, it'd be going off it there. I'll pop it up. And again, we're going to kind of line it up with the grass. There we go. Just like that. And our flowers, what I'm going to do is put some adhesive on that. I'm going to kind of do it like that. What do you think? No. Well, I think I like it better like, like so. Yeah, like that right there. Okay, sorry about that. Somewhere down there, my... I don't know what happened. My movie stopped or, I mean, my tape stopped or something, but... We'll just have to go back and fix that. But we're going to put our, our bow right there. Okay, and then we'll let these sort of dangle. That's very cute. And inside we have, no matter the weather, we're in it together. Let love grow. Okay. So we have that one and we'll put that with, we'll put our envelopes out here. Let's put that one with our pink envelope. And we could stamp something on the front of that. Oh, I love it. Hmm. This extra stamp set is beautiful. I think what I'm going to do is 
put the little I believe in you. Oh, that's nice. A lot of little sweets here. <laughs> Very cute. Let's just do these right here. Oops. On the outside of our envelope. That way we have something on there. I like that. Oh, that's cute. Very pretty. And we could do it on the front as well. First. Our second. Do that here. Sounds like my husband's getting ready to go somewhere, so best to cut this short. Okay. Well, I think I messed up here and didn't punch the, the right button on the camera, so I thought I was videoing the making of my little ribbon here, but apparently I didn't. But So, we'll have to cover that another time if it's not on this uh, recording. But we have some beautiful cards here that, that came in our paper pumpkin this month, and if you're not a subscriber, it's well worth your time. It... Um, helps you stay creative for only $22 a month. Um, you're provided everything that you need with the exception of hmm, the adhesive glue and um, I think that's about it. You have, oh, and the one well, they provide you the stampin' spot, you get the dimensionals, you get the glue dots, and you get the, the thread here, so it's quite a quite an opportunity and every month it's something different something to look forward to it um, helps keep you occupied helps keep you creative and it's just a good thing all around I've enjoyed it I've been with the company now this time I'm uh, going on over three years just had my third year anniversary and um, I love the things I am allowed to do with them with the company they there's so much motivation, uh, encouragement to create, share, and it's just a it's just a really good company to be with. 